In the mystical land of Japan, nestled amidst towering mountain ranges and ancient forests, three intrepid explorers embarked on a perilous quest. Mark, the adventurous leader with a penchant for history, had heard rumors of a sacred cave hidden deep within the mountain. It was said to house remnants of prehistoric cannabis, whispered to possess unimaginable power. Accompanying Mark were his trusted companions, Sarah, a fearless botanist with an insatiable curiosity, and Alex, a witty and quick-witted adventurer known for his light-hearted banter. Together, they formed an unlikely trio, bound by their shared desire to unravel the mysteries of the past. As they ventured into the heart of the mountain range, anticipation mingled with a sense of foreboding. The landscape unfolded before them, a tapestry of vibrant colors and towering trees. A misty veil clung to the air, veiling the path ahead in an enigmatic shroud. Mark's voice echoed through the dense forest, laced with determination. We are on the brink of uncovering something extraordinary, my friends. The legends speak of a cave where time itself seems to stand still. Sarah's eyes sparkled with excitement. Imagine the secrets that lie dormant within, waiting to be unearthed. This journey will be one for the aged. Their trek led them along treacherous trails, with each step drawing them deeper into the heart of mystery. The air grew heavy with suspense, as if the very mountains whispered ancient tales of long-forgotten civilization. Suddenly, the temperature dropped and an eerie silence fell upon the surroundings. The trio exchanged wary glances, their hearts pounding in anticipation. And then she appeared. Emerging from the mist like a wraith, the Yuki Honor, the Snow Woman, materialized before them. Her etherealized before them, her ethereal beauty concealed a chilling aura sending a shiver down their spines. The explorers felt the weight of her gaze, an unspoken warning. Mark's voice trembled, his words cautious. We mean no harm, great Yuki Honor. We seek the secrets of the cave where prehistoric cannabis await. The Yuki, Honor's voice, as cold as the icy wind, pierced the silence. Beware, mortals, for the treasures of the cave come at a great price. You tread on sacred ground, the tension in the air tightened as the explorers pressed forward, the Yuki Honor's presence casting a haunting pall over their every step. Shadows danced on the path, elongated and distorted, whispering secrets that sent shivers down their spine. Their progress became a precarious dance, each moment laced with anticipation and the ever-present threat of the Yuki Honor's wrath. Sarah's voice quivered, her gaze darting nervously. I sense her eyes upon us, we must proceed with caution. Alex, always the comic relief, tried to lighten the mood with a feeble joke. Well, if things get too intense, I'll just remind her that we brought our own chill factor with the cannabis. But the laughter died on their lips as an ethereal voice carried on the wind. Turn back, mortals. The darkness within the cave is not meant for your kind. Yet their resolve remained unyielding, fueled by their insatiable thirst for knowledge and the allure of the unknown. They pressed on, their footsteps echoing through the labyrinthine passageways. At last they reached the cavern, a subterranean cathedral where the whispers of ancient plants permeated the air. The prehistoric cannabis, bathed in an otherworldly glow, seemed to pulsate with a power that defied understanding. As they collected samples, a sense of urgency gripped them. Time seemed to slip away, and the Yuki Honor's chilling presence grew more palpable, their hearts pounded in their chests, the weight of the moment crashing upon them. Sarah's voice was filled with equal parts excitement and dread. We must hurry, my friends. The Yuki, honor draws near, and we cannot afford to be trapped in her icy clutches. They scrambled through the labyrinth, their footsteps echoing like thunder. The cave seemed to shift and twist, playing tricks on their senses, as if it were alive, unwilling to relinquish its secret. As the explorers hurriedly fled the haunted cave, terror gripped their hearts like icy tendrils. The Yuki, Honor's haunting wails, echoed through the mountains, making their skin crawl. Panic surged through their veins, and their desperate breaths filled the air with a cloud of fear. In the chaotic scramble, Sarah's foot slipped, causing her to lose her balance and stumble. As she tried to regain her footing, a ghostly figure materialized before her, the Yuki Honor's chilling eyes locking onto her. Frozen in fear, Sarah's heart pounded and her voice caught in her throat. Mark and Alex, fear etched on their faces, reached out to help her, but it was too late. The Yuki, 
Honor's icy grip closed around Sarah's ankle, sending a shock of numbing cold through her body. She let out a blood-curdling scream as the ghostly figure began to pull her toward the cavern's mouth. We can't leave her, Mark shouted, his voice filled with desperation. Alex nodded, his face pale, but he knew they had no choice. We have to keep going. It's the only way to survive. With heavy hearts, Mark and Alex tore themselves away from Sarah's anguished cries, their footsteps heavy with guilt and terror. They pushed onward each step, taking them further from their dear friend, their minds haunted by the sound of her voice fading into the distance. As they reached the edge of the mountain range, they glanced back, hoping against hope to see Sarah emerge unscathed. Instead, they saw the Yuki, Ona's icy form, retreating into the darkness of the cave, Sarah nowhere to be seen. Tears welled up in Mark's eyes as he choked back a sob. We should have stayed. We should have fought for her. Alex placed a comforting hand on Mark's shoulder, his own heart heavy with grief. We wouldn't have stood a chance against that creature. We can't save her now, but we can honor her memory. With heavy hearts and a deep sense of loss, they returned to their camp haunted by the terrifying encounter and the knowledge that they had left their friend behind. The once jovial atmosphere had turned somber, the weight of their harrowing experience hanging heavily in the air. Days turned into weeks, and the memory of their ill-fated expedition continued to haunt them. They vowed never to speak of the incident, afraid that acknowledging it might summon the vengeful spirit once more. Though they returned home physically intact, the emotional scars of that dreadful encounter would forever mark them. They were haunted by the chilling wails of the Yuki, honor and the memory of leaving their friend behind. In the depths of the night, they would hear faint whispers in the wind, a haunting reminder of the terror they had faced. The prehistoric cannabis they had collected sat untouched, a chilling reminder of the price they had paid for their curiosity. And so, the legend of the haunted cave lived on, a chilling warning to those who dared to seek the mysteries of the past, lest they too fall victim to the Yuki, Honor's icy wrath. The mountain range stood silent, holding the secrets of that fateful day, forever shrouded in mystery and terror.